Welcome back to my YouTube channel, y'all. And today, I'm gonna be doing you know, saying a movie review on the Move 102, y'all. So make sure y'all give a big thumbs up, you know what I'm saying? Make sure y'all comment down below and let me know if y'all can see anything. And don't mind how I look, you know what I'm saying? I'm just trying to get these videos out. I just dropped the third time, and if we do a reaction, and I want to do this video, you know what I'm saying? Because, like, why not? And I'm been a minute since so I did a, um, a movie review, so. I'm about to read y'all, you know what I'm saying, what the movie's about, and then I'm gonna give my rating and everything, and how I like things, though, so, yeah, make sure you give me a thumbs up to my channel, all that good stuff, and let's get into this video. Alright, y'all, so, this says, Zoe Brooks is still trying to figure out life, but this time in her 20s, Zoe and Chase did not end up with her wife that summer, and haven't heard from each other since. And it says, when close friends Quinn and Logan announced they're getting married, Zoe and Chase find themselves in the wedding party. So, y'all, basically, um, you know, like they say, Zoe Bush, you know what I'm saying, she was still figuring out life and everything. And then, Logan and Quinn was getting married and everything. So, I was like, oh my God, because, like, ever since, like, the show, I knew, like, they liked each other, you know what I'm saying? So, and y'all remember, like, the show, and they was, like, secretly, like, liking each other, thing. they didn't want their friends to know and everything, so, I was like, oh, my God, like, they were really getting married, so, yeah, she, um, uh, went to their wedding and everything, and she told her, she told Quinn that, you know, she had a little boyfriend or whatever, but she was lying, so, basically, she had to, like, hire, um, a boy to, like, play her boyfriend and everything, she did that to basically, like, say, like, oh, the boyfriend, I'm not thinking about chasing no more, and then when she found out Chase was coming, she was like, oh, my God, because, like, in this page, it says that, uh, Chase and her were supposed to end up in Hawaii that summer, but nothing, you know what I'm saying, never happened, so, it's like, seeing Chase for the first time, so I was just like, oh, 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 like, oh, my God, so that's why she was like, you know what, let me just, but I mean, little boyfriend over to make him think that I don't want him back, you know what I'm saying? But then she was doing this little daddy show, or whatever, and um, I think I can't even think what happened. She was, she was doing this little daddy show, and she got the car, or whatever. So she didn't even get uh, Logan and Queen with uh, rings. So she went, and then I guess Chase out there. So basically, Chase ended up going with her because. Well, he did, I wouldn't say he ended up going, he was kind of trapped because the car door was like automatic or something like that, you know, like shut on him. And then, you know, they went all the way down there to get the ring and everything. So they was actually talking. They end up like talking it out and, you know, I think they end up kissing something like that. So, you know, they were kind of like, you know, oh my God, oh my God. But then it was like, Zoe realized that she still had serious chase, you know what I'm saying? And then at the end of the movie, y'all, um, you know, Chase and Zoe end up getting back together when they um did like this little so basically they went back to PCA, the school they originally graduated from and they basically gave Queen and Logan like they you know, like a little wedding because the wedding they did have nothing was going on planned and you know, everything was falling apart. So Zoe and them was like, you know what, let's go back to PCA because we needed that and that's what they did they wedding at. So I thought that was definitely dope. But um uh, this movie was definitely like lit. This movie was definitely like a double. Like, this movie was funny as hell. Like, if y'all not watched this movie, you definitely can watch it. It's on Paramount Plus. It's called Zoe 102. Um, this movie was definitely lit. I was a cast member, you know what I'm saying? It's definitely good because Zoe was definitely, you know what I'm saying? The definition of don't mess with me. And I'm even though I'm a girl, I can still do it too, you know what I'm saying? Like, and I loved watching Zoe 101, like, when it was out on Nickelodeon and everything. But I definitely give the movie a 10 out of 10, you know what I'm saying? The movie definitely was dope, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, if you did not go watch it, you need to go watch it. It's definitely dope. And if I spoiled something in this, in this uh, not this video. Yeah, this video. I'm sorry. Y'all go watch the movie because, like I said, I didn't want to spoil too much. But Fade and Shine is definitely a good movie. You need to go watch it. It's very funny to us as well. And you, you know what I'm saying, see your favorite characters in them run and stuff, you know what I'm saying, like, per, but this is going to be the end of this, um, movie review, y'all, on Zoe 102, hope y'all enjoyed this video, make sure I give me a big thumbs up, my channel, all the good stuff, I do have more content on the way, y'all, it's going to run this up, like, period, make sure y'all subscribe to me, you know what I'm saying, and, um, yeah, y'all, I'm going to see y'all in the next video, hope y'all enjoyed this video, and I'm going to see y'all later, peace. I got too many hoes. Yeah, you, you like to put that shit in your door